dear friends so today we are going to introduce you about the console multiphysics <coughs> so i have installed the latest version of console 5.5 so let's take an example of this valuable software so wait until it opens so this is the latest version 5.5 and it's freely available on the internet you can find it or you can google it any where you will find it free this is a very good software for designing different types of uh, physical uh, quantities uh, physical or uh, engineering science fields from civil to mechanical electrical and so on <coughs> so you see this this is the main window of the console multiphysics it is file menu if you if you go to file menu you can click on new as the one of one way you can create the new project another way is you can go to the model wizard <coughs> there are different types of uh, geometries you can design uh, like i can i want to design 2d geometry so there are a lot of modules you can say acdc modules acoustics chemical species and so on <coughs> in this i will try to design the optics module and the optics category you can see this is the optics and in the optics we have different options electromagnetic <coughs> waves beam annular method you can see domain time exhibition and transient method so mostly i will use frequency domain method so this is the type of uh, physics module which i and which my design will work and the type of study i want to get or uh, extract the parameters so i will select the study from here then in the study you have these options whatever you can select so i will design an optical fiber so here there is model analysis so click it double click it or you can select it and then choose it as well so first option is to select the units and geometry section so you can see here i am selecting micrometer so click build all this is written here that it is this geometry this structure will be in micrometer scale <coughs> so there are different ways to create geometry but the easy way is to right click on this you will see lot of options here properties export into insert sequence parts and square ellipse circle and rectangle so we are you can go here you can see here is geometry in geometry you can see you will see all the basic things circle ellipse and rectangle square polygon point then if you don't find something here you will find these things and primitives you will see there are a lot of other options available here if you want to use them so i want to use just a circle so i put it selected from by right clicking here you can name it any like i have you can say i want to put it as core so here is here is the radius of the core you can give it radius up to <coughs> your choice i am going to put it as <coughs> it and you can also select the position whether you want to put it on corner or at center or you can even choose the coordinates x and y so if you 
If you are done with these parameters, then you can say build selected or build all. You will find some type of geometry, if not, but it's not visible here. Then you have to select this one, zoom extend button, and it will make it clear. Now the circle which we designed of 8 micro meter radius is visible here. You can see its radius from 0 to here is 0, 0 to you can say it's 8, it's radius. So overall it goes from almost 9 to uh, almost 8 to minus 8. <coughs> so same way you can create another circle which is like you can say another circle of cladding. So I am putting it as cladding. So its radius is almost uh, I will say it's radius uh, 62.5. So I want to put it again at the center. Build all objects again. Select the it's <coughs> zoom extend button. Now there is the core and the cladding. So we we just put the parameters here directly, but but you can also select parameters type and you can create like you can say that r1 s8 micrometer enter so this is the syntax of the console multi physics if you want to put any a unit you have to put in square brackets. This is the best way. The right the console will generate an error. Same way you can select R2. R2 is about 62.5 micrometer. Select this one as like this. So if we want to try this, here we can we want to put it as R1. There will be no change here. Same way we can put our two here. So this is the best way. The other thing is material. Then you can go to material type of material what you want. If you want to add something from library, then add material from library. If not, you can just choose in black material. Then you have to put refractor index values of your twice whatever the material refractor index is there okay 